bus, so now I have time to show you what I have. which is also like a little museum. It shows all the national parks in Sweden. sausages and marshmallows <laughs> but I didn't bring any today due to the heat wave because if we light any fire it will start a forest fire fire this because this year has been the hottest year in Sweden in a very very long time so there's no marshmallows today to the kids trail. This trail has a lot of excitement and it's fun for kids. Okay, here we are about to enter the trail. There's some information in English if you want to know. I call this trail the troll hunting trail because you see that rock over there. For me, it looks like a troll. Mm -hmm. Here's the clue box, which I'm gonna take a clue thing and a pencil. It is in Swedish. There is much to discover, so take plenty of time, perhaps an hour. The trail is indicated with red markings. Along the trail are 11 discovery sites. <laughs> uh, hiking here in Sweden is quite easy. 
today we're going to be following the red line. Uh, I remember one of the trails I went was blue, follow the blue dots, but this one is follow the red lines. Mm -hmm. so, so, so. The first clue is get the salmon, which means giant stone. You have to look at the big, uh, at the giant stone to answer the clue. On the giant stone, it's over there. The stone has a face. Yeah, that's what I think because I see um, eye, eye, nose, mouth over there. I can show you quickly. the mysterious letter which is the letter S but let's move on to the next one it's very easy to find the red line found the answer to the question and the mysterious letter but I just realized that I shouldn't tell you guys that all the answers because you have to do it yourself question is called Graven, which means the grave. Yeah, this one is easier, easier than the others, mm -hmm. but I'm not going to tell you guys. <laughs> So this question is about that thingy, which...
I can tell you a, l a little bit about this machine. So it's like a game. So if you turn it to one and you turn around, and then you'll get the sound of the animal here. Let's try and hear what how the moose sounds like. It's number six. We have a little tail to f o l l o Weird sound, but I like it. Number eight looks like something in English. So let's try. We have a little tail, so for the hara. With this listening device, you can hear sounds of the Swedish forest. The black woodpecker is a skillful excavator. The nesting holes it leaves behind are used by owls and other birds, even bats. Cool. Next one is hängbro, which means hanging bridge. There's gonna be some hanging. trail for me but I want you guys to come and do this trail it's really fun and it's really easy and there's many adventures now it's lunch time let's go
I'm going to take the bus home again, and I hope to see you next video. Bye!